All right, South Africa, Botswana and Namibia joining forces. They're conducting road safety operations on the Trans-Kalahari Corridor. ENCA reporter Aviu Mdila joins us from Rustenburg where some of the operations are taking place. Good morning, Aviu. Just talk us through the operation this morning. Morning, Pudlo, and we're already seeing high volumes of traffic here, yeah? and majority of the trucks going through, of course, the Trans-Kalahari Corridor Secretariat yeah? with of course the routes leading with the member states which include Botswana and Namibia just to get an idea of what we can expect especially heading to the festive season I am joined by the chair of the Trans Kalahari Corridor Secretary here that's uh, Sir Khodi Mokoto thank you for joining us at ENCA but maybe paint a picture of the volumes that we're seeing ahead of the festive season now yeah thank you thanks very much uh, colleagues uh, the Trans Kalahari Corridor as, as we said earlier it connects the three member states Botswana Namibia and South Africa the volumes are quite high, especially uh, of, of trucks, because of the, 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 those two member states, we do a lot of a trade with Botswana and Namibia. So you can see the volumes of trucks that are here uh, mostly, they are going uh, into Namibia, they are going to, in, into Botswana, uh, moving the trade uh, between uh, and amongst the three member states. But, and it goes beyond uh, those three member states. We have seen volumes, uh, trucks that, 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 that passes through this corridor into Zambia and Angola. So it plays a very significant role. So going to Festive, we'll see even much more uh, volumes going up uh, 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 amongst those three member states. And I see the different law enforcement entities here. Maybe paint a picture of what exactly you are doing here, what are you searching for, and the people that you're working with. Thank you very much. We are joined as well by the law enforcement agencies from Botswana and Namibia. We have a head of traffic from, from Botswana who is here. Uh, we've got a uh, deputy commissioner of, 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 of police from, from Namibian police as well who, uh, who's here. This we are doing to signify the, the, the working relationships that we are doing with our, uh, with our member states, uh, coordinated by our memorandum of, of, of understanding of the three member states. We are looking at one, issues of compliance to uh, ru uh, ru uh, ru rules of the road, especially for our truckers. We are looking at also uh, uh, issues around uh, the movement of uh, contrabands. Uh, our police are here. Uh, they are looking as well issues of, of, of illegal uh, uh, immigrants who might be moving uh, along our corridor. We want to deal with issues around human trafficking and any other challenges that might be a challenge amongst those three member states. And you mentioned that the volumes can be expected to increase going into the festive season. I can imagine, given that uh, we are past the COVID-19 regulations now, and that volume will surely be higher. Are you having any stricter law enforcement measures over the festive period? Yes, uh, the Department of Transport and other agencies will soon launch uh, their, uh, uh, the, the, the festive uh, law enforcement uh, plan uh, to look into those uh, challenges uh, and how to respond to some of the growing volumes of traffic uh, 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 on, on this corridor specifically, but it will be also a national program. But on this one is a law enforcement operation that is hosted by member states, member states being Botswana, South Africa, and Namibia. This time around is South Africa. We, the last time that we hosted this was in Sokobundi, Namibia in 2019, but because of COVID, in the past two years, we could not host this event uh, amongst the member states. So this one, uh, it, 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 it moves into the festive as, as, as well, but the focus is, 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 is on how do we do trade as, as three member states, how do we improve our relationship as, as, as three member states. They have that, we've got that delegates here, over 60 from Botswana and Namibia, who are also coming to observe uh, what we do. Part of the challenges as well is what Namibians are experiencing with, with South Africans, is what Botswana are experiencing with South Africans, but also what you're experiencing as challenges from Botswana, from Namibia. We brought everybody here to say, let's work together. How do we improve our relationship together? How do we streamline our processes as member states to ensure that one, there's effective law, law, law enforcement, but also uh, uh, trade uh, movement amongst the three member states. Just lastly, we've been here since 8 o'clock in the morning. What have you picked up? Any arrests or anything of the nature? Just now when, we, when we're standing here, three illegal Im Im immigrants without documents uh, have just been uh, handed over to, to, to SAPS by Home Affairs. We have this continued some of the uh, uh, cars that are found not to be compliant with our uh, uh, Road Traffic Act and other legislation. So we've got our different law enforcement uh, that are here from SARS. Uh, just yesterday, uh, 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 colleagues dealing with um, an, uh, an environmental uh, 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 matters, they found a truck full of uh, 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 
we have viennas, the meat products, and all of those that, that are still not to be compliant uh, with, with the health regulations. And all of those were confiscated by our health inspectors and were, were destroyed just to ensure that our people are fed uh, with proper uh, uh, food materials uh, that are recognized by the country itself. All right, thank you very much. And the chair of the Trans Kalahari Corridor Secretaries, yeah, of course, which include Botswana, Namibia, as well as South Africa, headed to the festive season. They're beefing up their operations yeah, to ensure that uh, there is smooth traveling in between the three member states, especially with the trucks and the cargo going through uh, to the various countries.